Welcome to our channel www.news.co.id Hello guys, meet with me again in new CNC channel. Okay, in the previous video, we have already learning about how to create login and loading form using Visual Basic, of course, with MySQL database. Okay, uh, in this video, I'm gonna show you how we can styling font using Visual Basic with uh, the font that not listed on the default font that bring by Microsoft Visual Studio. Okay, in this case, uh, I will show you how we can make digital font. Digital font is font like uh, that using in a clock guys usually using in uh, watts and ATC uh, okay first before we make a uh, digital font the first thing that uh, we must to do is download the digital font that extension is .ttf like this okay uh, we can just uh, we cannot just uh, make digital font but anything fonts you want to styling in visual basic you can download and you can uh, modifying with some code okay this is my digital font that I already download okay uh, i back in visual studio to make it you can see here uh, this zero is not a digital font in this case uh, this is a uh, lut the name of item i'm sorry uh, you can see this is lut guys not digital font but we using uh, Microsoft Sans Serif in here, okay? I will styling this phone with digital phone. The first thing that we must to do is inserting uh, digital phone to our resource, to our project. I mean uh, adding resource to our project, okay? I go to desktop to my digital font guys and adding this to all file and click open in here yes after we importing the digital fonts you can see in the resource is like this okay after that uh, we must to create a module and for TD project I will create folder you can see guys I got okay I will uh, if the folder name is style this is just just for example and then in the style folder I will click add and adding module of course later you can download this project in www.news.co.id that's web that's VB I will give the name of module is my phone and I click it in here okay uh, we need to give some code I will import the system drawing and then I will also uh, import system runtime guys And in the inside of module my phone in here, 
I will create a uh, some variables. This is, for example, I will create a PVFC as private font collection and equal to nothing. And then I will also create a public. This is just read only properties, guys. So. Uh, I'm using bival and size a single okay And I will also create a conditional statement, guys. If underscore pvc is nothing, so And then I will return because I'm using get a uh, function in here, so I must return. Okay, uh, after this, we need to uh, create load from load from uh, declaration, guys. So I will uh, try to. You can see, private sub. You can doing like this, guys, in Visual Studio. Okay, I I trying to using this uh, advice. I will enter. You can see uh, private sub lot phone in here, but uh, I don't need to discuss. Then I will to create. Uh, function itself okay create a uh, main pointer guys main pointer sorry interpreter equal to Marshall dot and uh, this is I want to load um, my resource in the project that uh, we have adding just now guys I will uh, adding my digital phone 7 in here Loading to my dot resource 
digital seven dot link in here okay and then i'll show marshall And then I create to load in here. Okay. Underscore PVC. And after that, guys, because this is uh, often error, we need to create a try statement for handling this error. And I will put gets into the last of the statement. Okay, uh, but in the or in this case I don't want to show the error but if you want to show error you can see or you can mix with the message box exception okay and then I think it's enough this is for showing uh, digital phone before that I will show you before before I implementing the digital phone into our project guys you can see in my loading form and my label in form user that using default phone in this case is Microsoft Sans Serif you can see this is uh, using default phone but now uh, I'm gonna show you how to make this is a digital phone also I, I will uh, make this hello Sony to digital phone and the first I'm I, I, I must go to uh, login from interface or loading from interface I double click and then uh, I will load the digital phone we uh, I'm sorry I will load the digital phone when the form is load by uh, program okay in this case is from loading guys the name of the form and I will calling you can see my label one this is the name is a load you can see guys this is a load and so I will a load dot phone I will change uh, this one to my phone my phone is uh, my module that we use that we created uh, just now okay and 
then my phone I will to get instance here and the size is you can see guys the size as single I want to uh, 48 and then the font style is uh, bold okay font style is bold I click shift and try to uh, seeing if our script is right Sony one two three four five you can see guys it works now this is a digital phone and I will also make the form user in this case the label one to make styling phone to digital so I double click in the form user and double click in the form load and then label one dot form equal to my phone dot get instance the size is I want to make uh, 68 for example and font style is bold okay I starting project again and see how it works I hope uh, this is nothing mistake show I click login this is is works but we also need to see the form user that's showing digital form you can see here guys okay it works and I will uh, bring this to left to more uh, center it okay enough Sony one two three four five okay I think this tutorial will enough or enough how to create digital phone using Microsoft Visual Basic okay that's all guys thanks for watching and in the next video I will uh, explaining about how we can create uh, automatic numbering for ID some form that we usually need for identification or primary key and also I will uh, show you how we can uh, controlling other form using master form okay and stay tuned with me thank you oh before I forget you can download all project in the www.news.co.id slice web slice vb okay Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.